Hello and welcome back to Tears of the Kingdom. I'm Vic and you're watching yet another Let's Play channel. And here we are, looking down on the Tiflo ruins. And also, would you look at that? That labyrinth, which I believe... Yeah, it's also up there. It didn't just lift into the air. It's still right where it was. There's just an air version. <laughs> Which just makes it all the more interesting, doesn't it? So I definitely want to hit this tower, which is the penultimate tower. And, uh... Hmm. Yeah, the problem is that, although it is close as the raven flies, um, I'm not a raven. And I will have to put in some work to get over there. And that work will include getting past the Frost Gleelock that just absolutely wrecked me the last time I saw him. Um, I'm better equipped and I have more hearts now than I did then, but not that much better, I don't think. Oh, I was not even paying attention to my stamina. Yeah, why not? Good. Oh. oh. I forget to push the button. What am I paying three for? For the wheel that got away? Good job, me. Go grab that wheel. Why am I using that? That's totally a waste. I don't even know if I want to use that. I'm just holding on to it because I don't have anything better to put in that spot right now. Get juggled, goofball. So, are all the sages this awesome, or did I just conveniently pick the best one first? I mean, was I guided to the best one first, I guess. I kind of wish he'd ride alongside me. I think instead he just goes back into the ring. Which is a reasonable thing to do, but it's not the most fun thing to do, right? Oh, hi there, Octorok. Don't mind me. What? Oh. Why is your stuff down there? Don't worry. I got it. I'll hold on to it for you. But I won't give it back. I'm just... I'm just going to hold on to it for you. Now, it, is it just me, or did there used to be a way to uh, get to this place, and now it's surrounded by bottomless swamp? Oh, it's Thiflo Ruins. Well, I got most of the letters right. Right? Right. Oh, the way in might be over here. Just let those go those guys toot their horns. They're not hurting nobody. Yeah, that that looks bridgy over there. So are the lost woods gone? No, those are related to the the other forest. Yeah, you guys have fun. I don't need to play with you. You break my toys, and I might have to play with you then. 
There's a Korok on top of this statue. Might as well get going with that. And... Bloop. Thank you, bye-bye. Another bridge. I might be able to get my car across that bridge. No, I think it's too narrow. But there is no harm in trying. These wheels are pretty capable. Alright, car. I guess this is where we part ways. You know... I didn't ever really get a good look at this place before, but, uh, it seems different. You know, stuff like this is uh, what le me leads me to think that there may have been some temporal tampering on Zelda's part. Uh, it seems to me that the culture that left these ruins behind is not re very reflective of the culture that uh, also built the Temple of Time and left behind those awesome powers and built a bunch of devices that were stored in pods so that you can just put them in your pocket until you're ready to use them. And, you know, you could say, oh, well, that's th these are just remnants of, you know, the culture's ancient past, whereas the stuff you're talking about is more modern. But, uh... Rauru himself said that he founded the Kingdom of Hyrule, so what were they before that? Did they just go from, like, wandering primitives to suddenly being super advanced? Why are these three dragons sleeping together? The Florune Skyview Tower. And what is the story here going to be? Hmm. The door's open. That's probably not a good sign. Yeah, it isn't working. Great. Good evening. Seems we meet again, eh? Sorry, this Skyview Tower is out of order and maintenance is proving tricky. What's wrong? Well, the terminal that starts the tower isn't working. I've checked all the terminal's parts, but nothing looks broken. Aww. I wonder if something to do with the tower itself is broken. That's what I wanted to hear. Oi! Yes? Hey. Hello, my brother in research. I was waiting for you. You were? Oh. That's right. I'm the one who discovered these big ruins way out here. Well, that's not true. I definitely visited this place. But I wasn't able to make much progress investigating them. Aww. I'm only one Hillian, and this, alas, is not a one Hillian job. That's why I wrote the Zonai survey team, asking them to dispatch a researcher to assist me. Mm. And here you are, sorry about that. <gasps> and here you are practically right after I sent my letter, great response time. What, you're not a Zonai survey team member? You're just some guy? No, I am not just some guy. I am the hero of the wilds. Does that mean I'm the hero of the tears now? I see. So few people come through here. I assumed you had to be, had to be my assistant I asked for. My mistake. <laughs> 
After all the trouble I've gone to, can't they send one assistant to help with my monolith research? Monolith research? Oops, did you hear that? Sorry, scrub that from your brain. It's not meant to be public knowledge. If you were from the Zonai survey team, I could tell you all about what I've discovered so far, but you're not, so... Well, let me help anyway. Hmm. I appreciate the offer, but that's really not allowed. Then again, though he may not be a researcher, he does have the look of an adventurer about him. Maybe his expertise will help will get things back on track. Ah. You know what? You're hired. For this project alone, I'm appointing you as my research assistant. Come on, let's find out what secrets these ruins are hiding. Oh. Well then, we can dive right in. I'll start by showing you what my research has uncovered so far. Wait there. Oof. Take a look. I think you'll be pretty surprised by this discovery. Display the power of the Sage of Wind to the owl protected by many dragons. Yeah, okay. Mm. Eh, eh? Aren't you surprised? Yeah, wow. Uh. Right? Right? Ah. The Zonai were an ancient civilization with their own system of writing. Almost no one living today can read Zonai script. But you can read the inscription on that monolith, right? That's because it's written in Hyrulean. Though these ruins appear to be Zonai in origin, they feature text written in modern Hyrulean. How could that be? Who built these ruins and for what purpose? Oh. This is just a possibility, but the monoliths that were found might be pointing to a spot somewhere in the ruins. You and me, we're going to get to the bottom of this. I need you to find that spot. There we may find yet another monolith that tells us why these ruins were built. Uh -huh. It's just a hunch, but it's also your boss's hunch. So... The Owl Protected by the Dragons. Yeah, okay. Well, this looks like a bunch of dragons, and maybe that's an owl. Child. I called for you. So, how about that? Easy. Oh, a goodie. Don't mind if I do. Boo! I thought I was going to get a sage's will or whatever. You found it? The place the monolith was talking about? So that's where it was. Excellent work. I'll go take a look shortly. Hmm. Seems there's nothing more you can help me with for now. I'll investigate alone for a while. Just check back in when I inevitably make a new discovery. I'm counting on you. Cool story. I wonder if I need to play with these platforms in order to get the tower working. There we go. I'm going to mess you right up. Alright. Well, since I need to be up high, this is convenient. We'll just uh, launch one at a time, I think. Oh, gee, I wonder what the problem is. What am I going to do about it from here? Yeah. That'll work. Oops. 
So that means that they built the tower, and then this floaty platform just f floated over it. I guess that makes sense. They were working on that stuff before the upheaval, as near as I can tell. I do kind of like the idea that uh, the floaty platforms are just blowing around in the wind, popping up all over the place. Makes this world even more exciting. The terminal. It's working again, even though I didn't do anything. Yeah, I did it. Huh? There was something blocking the top of the Skyview Tower? Hmm. The terminal and the lid on top of the tower are connected. So if the lid wouldn't work because it was blocked, I guess the terminal wouldn't work either. Well, I'm in a hurry and everything seems to be working properly, so I'll head out. Uh. Thank you for fixing the Skyview Tower. I'm off. And we go to space once again. Hook me up. Pajum. You know, the best part about Link is he gets shot into low Earth orbit and it doesn't even muss his hair. Oh, there's a Korok there. Oh, you know, I'm probably high enough up that I could get over to those ruins if I wanted to. Alright, let's do it. Or do I want to do my usual thing and try and land on some sky stuff? There's the sword geoglyph. Oh, look at that. It's one of the little flower islands. That's worth doing. I should be wearing the proper shirt for this. Where is it? There it is. Yeah, this is what I'll do. Oh, and there's another geoglyph guarded by uh, the Gliok. All right, so what have we got here? Uh, oh, that's not what I wanted. Where's that going to land? Did it fall into a chasm? How incredibly rude. I think it did. Yeah, straight down into that chasm. Well, what the hell, man? Hmm. Can I make it to the Sky Ruins? Probably not. I'm, I'm running low on stamina. Are they even oriented the same as the Ground Ruins? I think so. It's close. I could eat some. I could eat some stamina and maybe do it. But I don't want to. gotta save those for special occasions because I haven't been able to farm up many stamina goods yet. Oh uh, yeah, that doesn't work. <laughs> Unbearable cold. Well, can I keep my shirt then? Yeah, alright. Too slow. Oh, it's still got the same music. So what happens if we go to the middle?
there's a chasm in the middle and a shrine. So what do I want to do about this? Oh, there's some gloomy hands down there. Don't want to play with those. It would be nice if I could just find the correct place for a bit of cheese. I don't know. Yeah, that wasn't as exciting as I thought it might be. So the malice seems to have been replaced by gloom. Wonder why that is. Um, gimme. And... Gimme. What do we got in here? A pine cone. I don't super need a pine cone right now, do I? No, I don't think I do. Although they are everywhere. Maybe they're trying to encourage me to get up above it. But he, who needs to do that? Research log day four. I've done it. At long last, I've done it. I've found a relic of the Zonai civilization, though my euphoria is short-lived. In the hours since my discovery, I've tried touching, hitting, and yelling at the relic, but it remains unresponsive. I'm starting to fear that I may not unravel the secrets of the Zonai after all. The thought makes the cold even more bitter. Well, fine. I suppose it's time I crawl out of this frigid pit and issue my report on my investigation. That's not just any chasm. Alright. Gimme and... There it is. Gimme. That big ice is stubborn. No, you guys leave me alone. You're not welcome in here. You hear me? You stay out there, jerks. Do you think this will open up for me? It's got to, right? Why else would it be? There. For you who conquered this labyrinth of the land, I, the ruler of owls, have unlocked a door. Find it on the west side of the labyrinth of the sky. The North Lome Prophecy. Can I climb the ruins? Is there enough that I can do that? Obviously, I still want to do the shrine, but... Oh, look at that. No, no, wrong button, damn it. All right. Big battery. Cool, I guess. So we're back up here. Oh, that's, that's too far to... To up into. Let me point the scope straight up. That labyrinth up there doesn't have a floor. That's what you might call inconvenient. North Lome Prophecy. Oh, it's just a gift. Diamond. 
it's not even that exciting anymore. I'm actually to a point where I'm ready to just start selling them. Thank you. Bye-bye. So how am I supposed to get up there? And how am I supposed to get down there? Do I have to do I have to go up there and use the door that opened to go down here? I guess that would make a certain amount of sense. Hang on. What is that? Yeah, so now I'm up here, and I definitely can't up to there. Mm, hot air balloon is right in the middle. Why not give it a shot? I don't use these very often, so there's no point to search by most used. Just gotta take the long way. So, balloon. And then what do I want to do with balloon? Do I have carts? I have carts. And I have more carts than I do balloons. All right, we'll do this. Another balloon. Yeah. Nope. That one. No. Don't be silly. Do it again, you're gonna do it again. Fine. You wanna be that way? Be that way. I said be be that way. What's the problem here? There we go. And finally couple of power. Now this might be a long trip, so maybe I should battery it up a little bit too. Yeah. And just stick those any old wear. What order are they going to get used up in, I wonder? That might create a slight problem for me. Hey. Alright, child. Uh, goodbye. Wow, it's really sucking up that battery. That might be a problem for me. That might also be a problem for me. Two batteries down already. And I still have a long way to go. If I need to, I can build another one. Wow, that thing is way up there. Uh, 
Should we keep going? We should keep going for a little bit. We're going to run out of battery soon anyway. We're getting close, though. Should I try and ride it all the way up, or should I bail here? Nearby, up above. I really appreciate that it says the up above and below part now. That's definitely an improvement. That's not what I wanted to do. Can I catch it? On his way down? I might have missed it. Okay, well, we're all out of time, so come back and see me again tomorrow, and I will continue my ascent into the unknown. Talk to you soon.